American Red Cross is making sure people have a place to go as flooding forces even more people out of their homes. KWA's and Kirika Azuka in Fort Smith with a family and how they're coping. The flooding here in the River Valley has people in less than ideal situations. I spoke to a family who say they are grateful for what the American Red Cross has done for them. The Red Cross opened this shelter at the Evangel Temple in Fort Smith on Friday for those who have been evacuated from their homes. Sarah Burris and her two kids, Anna and Noah, came here Saturday morning after they got news the Moffat house they were staying in was completely underwater. Burris says the shelter isn't ideal, but she's grateful it's an option. Scary at first, but once you get there, um, people are really nice and they try to help you out as much as they can. Shane Maddox, who is also staying at the shelter, agrees. He says this is the worst flooding he's seen and is glad the Red Cross gave him somewhere to go. Thank you for helping me out as well, you know, supporting me and keeping me safe and fed and showered and healthy, you know. Now, volunteers tell me that the shelter here is open to anyone. People should bring things like clothes and toiletries that'll last them for a few days. And if you want to help, financial donations are always welcome. We'll have a link to that on our website, nwahomepage.com. In Fort Smith, in Kirikazoka, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News.